everyone, I'm Lisa Weinhold. I'm the principal flutist of the Alabama Symphony Orchestra. This is my dog, Leah. And together, Leah and I are going to read a book called Becoming Bach. What, Leah? No, not Bark. Bach. B-A-C-H. I hope you enjoy it. Becoming Bach by Tom Leonard. For three strong women without whom this book wouldn't exist, my mother Teresa, my agent Libby, and my wife and muse, Rose. There was always music. Music was always being played. When it wasn't being played, I heard it in my head. My family had been musicians for over 200 years. In our part of Germany, musicians were called Bachs. I always wanted to be a Bach. We would bring our instruments and play and sing on a hillside. Even our picnics had music. I learned to play the harpsichord the trumpet, the violin, the flute, and the organ. And I sang in my strongest voice. After mother and father went to heaven, I needed to say things, but words weren't enough. I walked over 30 miles with my brother, Johann Jacob, to live with our oldest brother, Johann Christoph. He taught me music. I loved to copy music, but my brother hid the hard music from me. I found it when he was sleeping at night and copied it. All of it. The music made patterns on the page. The patterns made music when you played them. Patterns like the designs on my mother's dress. Patterns like the ripples on the surface of the river. New sounds, happy sounds, quiet sounds, Yellow sounds, red sounds, blue sounds, all the sounds in my head. I needed to make patterns, so I wrote music. Patterns of sounds, patterns of invention, just seven notes. Every note made a different sound. Just seven notes. Two notes together made a different sound. Three notes together made an even more different sound. What sounds could I make with seven notes? I saw patterns everywhere I looked. When I got my first job as a church organist, I sat down at the organ, I looked at the massive pipes that seemed to rise up to heaven above, the manuals on the keyboards all lined up in black and white, the pedals on the pedal board beneath my feet. I looked at the stops in rows like notes on a page. I pulled out all the stops. and I produced the largest sound possible, a sound that could be heard for miles. It was a mighty sound. It was a sound that would be heard forever. It was the sound in my head. It was then that I knew I had become a Bach, Johann Sebastian Bach. The music that you've heard in the background while we've read the story is me playing my flute. I'm playing the A minor partita of Johann Sebastian Bach. It's one of my favorite pieces. Did you enjoy the story? I did. And this is my other dog, Fi. She enjoyed it too. Thank you for being with me for Becoming Bach by Tom Leonard. <laughs>